COVID-19 Prevention for Alzheimer's Patients While it is not likely for Alzheimer's patients to be more prone to COVID-19 just as how it doesn't increase risks for flu, their age, common health concerns that accompany the condition, and disease-related behaviors can increase their susceptibility to this deadly virus. For instance, an Alzheimer's patient might forget to take the necessary precautions to prevent COVID-19 or doing something as simple as washing their hands. With the world still facing the threat of this pandemic, it has even become even more critical for caregivers to pay attention to its potential risks and follow extra safety precautions for patients living with Alzheimer's disease. Tips for Home-Based Alzheimer's Patients Caregivers Caregivers of people who live with Alzheimer's disease and other forms of dementia are recommended to follow the set guidelines of the CDC or Centers for Disease Control. Here are some tips you need to remember and consider. Increased confusion is usually the initial symptom of an illness like Alzheimer's and other forms of dementia. If the person who lives with Alzheimer's shows quickly increased confusion, get in touch with your patient's healthcare provider for professional advice. Unless the patient has a very high fever or finds it hard to breathe, it is highly recommended to contact the healthcare provider first instead of heading straight to the emergency room. The doctor might be able to address the issue with no need for a hospital trip. Patients with Alzheimer's might require written or additional support and reminders to ensure that they don't forget the important practices for hygiene from day to day. For instance, you can put some signs in the bathroom and other areas to remind Alzheimer's patients to wash their hands for 20 seconds with soap and water. Demonstrate and show them how to do thorough and proper hand washing. If hand washing might not be possible all the time, such as when the patient cannot go to the sink to wash their hands, you can use an alcohol-based hand sanitizer with an alcohol content of at least 60%. Ask the doctor or pharmacist about filling the prescription for more days to lessen the trips to the local pharmacy. Think in advance and come up with good alternative plans for the Alzheimer's patient in the event respite or adult daycare is cancelled or modified as a response to COVID-19. Think ahead and consider making alternative plans on how to go about care management if you get sick yourself. It is highly recommended for caregivers to get proper guidance when it comes to providing proper care for Alzheimer's patients in the event of a major disease disaster or outbreak. Now, even if you take the necessary precautions yourself, any outside person who enters the home may pose the risk of spreading the virus. The risk of exposure is higher for people who live with Alzheimer's who are usually older and already have a lot of underlying health concerns. Make sure you coordinate these safety measures with your patient's family. This video is not intended to be a substitute for professional medical advice, diagnosis, or treatment, and does not constitute medical or other professional advice. Always seek the advice of your physician or other qualified health providers with any questions you may have regarding a medical condition. Thank you for watching this video. If you want more of these videos, please like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. iSavta is committed to connecting you, caregivers, with employers all over Israel. We offer the easiest way for caregivers to look for jobs. Visit our website, www.isavta.co.il and sign up for free.